Fiddler. This is the called the the Lair. The Lair Lounge. The Lair Lounge. Pandemic hit. We just had it left here. We've been here the whole time. We potted up. Yeah, this was our bubble. It was both of you It's kind of a think piece. It's also a bit of a who done it. Where we were versus where we're going. Who we're gonna be. Who we've been trying to be lately. Got some new pedals. We started running. Turned it up. We were running through the electrode over here. We plug this, the ukulele in. The ukulele has a contact mic in it. So, you plug that in. And then you just blow in it. Oh, that's kind of nasty, huh? Sounds nasty. One thing that I was was getting really into was running the um, talk box into the groove effects and you just kind of ow, 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 ow. and then Zach got these effects going the nebulizer the nebulizer just started freaking it out and it just sounds Arturia nebulizer it sounds like chaos theory feels right We also got the Dremel. You remember you did the Dremel? Oh yeah. yeah. Um, bass, bass. Grab that bass. Yeah, the Dremel on the on the. Bass. But it's the back side. Yeah, the back side. Maybe. Yeah, basically yeah. like just had the Dremel turned it on, but not drilling. And every time we touch it, it makes this crazy squelch. See? It's because these are passive, and these right. are active. Right. And so it. It's reverse engineering. You were like doing the hi hat with the rain stick was like a right. Thing that we had well, the rain stick was getting sweaty though, so we had to get it a sweatband. They were hooking that up. It was just so sweaty. And then miking it with this, and just we we're getting like this. Uh, yeah. When you when you mess with the squelch, right, right here, you get that all the way up, and then. I'll keep it all day of it that. Yeah. Vocals were tough. Vocals were tough. pissed. Yeah, pissed off a little. You know? Just trying to capture it. Just trying to capitalize. A lot of the yeah, sound the way that we did is like all this screamy stuff. We like, um, oh, here. Yeah. This OP1 has an oh, old right. right. Whoa. Gotta turn it down. Check, check. What's up? See? It's kind of got like, it's pretty bright, but you know. EQ the fucker. Yeah. That is, that's the vocal, the screamings. Stripped it down, got to the grassroots. What we, uh, we stripped it, we planed it, we stained it. We started running a 128 system and it's just really kind of we are really here, yeah, the, yeah, and the, the, the um, ceiling is way higher, you know? The floor got pulled out and the ceiling got high. The frequency response with us. I never felt more productive. Productivity went out the roof. Right. Because it, when it sounds good, you, it makes you it work. It sounds like productivity. You want, you want to work when it sounds that good. It all really boils down to the clean power, though. That's really what it does. The stilettes. Yeah. We got good power in LA. Yeah, the, the box just, you know. Well, I mean, it's indescribable. It just makes it so you can get the signal that you want. Yeah. We're also just like capturing audio on our box. Okay. So it's like the canvas, you know? And then we're just painting shit like this, all this shit. It's just like painting on it. That's art. 